for me, there's few places on earth more beautiful than Charleston, South Carolina. Defined by its old southern charm and its breathtaking views of the Charleston Harbor, an inlet of the Atlantic Ocean formed by the Ashley and Cooper Rivers. Waterways that literally put this historical city on the map almost 400 years ago. And now, these waters are what bring me back to the South Carolina low country. Today I'm here in Folly Beach, South Carolina to go try something that I have not done before with my new friend John. John is from Sup Safaris. What's up? Not much. How are you this morning? I'm good, man. Sup, stand up paddleboard. See this on a shirt? Just like that. That's what we're going to try today. What do I need to be worried about? Sharks? Uh, everybody always asks about sharks and alligators. Good. And we only have doll friends in the water. Doll friends? Mm -hmm. Like a dolphin, but a friendly one. You got it. So if you see a fin, it's your doll friend. Let's get after it. Come on. Speaking of doll friends, I was excited to have my own two friends, Martin and Dan, joining me today to tackle this exciting day on the water. Folly River that we do all of our paddleboard tours on is a tidal river. So the tide goes up and down by up to six feet. Oh, wow. So in the fact that it's not a lake and it's not somewhere where we can take our first time clients out on the water and just kind of paddle around and know that we can come back, we have the van and the trailer, which is attached in the back, and that guarantees when the wind picks up or if the tides aren't perfect for us, then we can start at the boat ramp where our shop is and we can float down to where we're heading now, which is my business partner Richard's house. We have 15 people or is the max number of people on our tours because we have a 15 passenger van. Simple That's mass. great, man. Simple mass. Big John, as he's known to the locals, was born in Hawaii, where stand up paddle boarding originated and spread in popularity. John developed a deep passion for outdoor education and environmental stewardship, all along honing his teaching skills as a paddling instructor. And I can assure you, those skills would really be put to the test today. This might surprise you. I'm not in like perfect shape. Bro, I would have never been able to tell Thank anything you. Like I that. know. I've really been, been trying to you take care of myself. You told me you're on TV. I figured you were doing just fitness shows. Right. Well, you know, with my flotation device securely fastened in the event of a water landing, I think I was finally ready for a few pointers. Your bottom arm is straight, and now you're pushing with your top arm. You're making me feel not near as nervous about this as I actually want to be. I mean, I've always wanted to have long hair. I don't know if you ever wanted a beard, but I feel like we could just swap, swap off tips. Yeah. Yeah. We could do like a whole stick, right? Have you always had long hair? It's magical. With a last minute pep talk to settle our fears, the river was calling our name, and we climbed onto our paddle boards. Yeah, all right, we're paddle boarding. We are. We're nice and wide, ready stance. The wind is just blowing us Find it for you, not for me. Even Big John admitted the current was a little faster today, but I think we were getting the hang of things. You never know that I, I skateboarded for 15 years. Not that that translates at all. We were having such a great time with John out on the water, a place he feels most comfortable. With years of experience directing international service programs all over the world, John has maintained that passion for community service in this community organizing two charity races every year to build positive youth development through opportunities in water sports. And today, Big John instilled that same passion in me. I'm sailing! I sail! We navigated the rough waters of the Folly River today. Shoulders square, feet firmly planted, cruising some of the most historic waters in our nation. And as I looked out upon the distant horizon, Remembering those brave men that risked their lives on these very waters 400 years ago, with each paddle we gain strength, courage, and confidence. With fear in our face and the wind at our backs, we stood proud. Until we didn't. Yeah! Oh, yeah. For more videos, check out forwhatyoudo.com.